I'm seeing a lot of Totoro's everywhere, Totoro handbags, a lot of green. Um, it's, it's a lovely atmosphere. It's been a really lovely collaboration actually with the entire company and Phelim and Basil and our Japanese co-producers and it's been fun. We're thrilled. I just can't believe we're finally here. I've grown up seeing him on screen and then to kind of see that manifest. It's a bit of a dream come true really. <laughs> We've seen it about 50 times, most recently about two hours ago on the drive here. So we wanted to fully research what scenes would be in and what scenes wouldn't. I'm looking forward to an exciting uh, evening in the theatre. It's exciting for me as a Japanese national. It's exciting for me as an actor based here in England. But the ticket sales have been absolutely stupendous, so I'm, I'm, I'm agog. What did I think? I didn't think, I felt it. Oh, Joe Hisoishi's music is abs I mean, it just is ravishing. And Will Stewart, who's our orchestrator, has done the most beautiful job of adapting it. And the musical uh, is still good. <laughs> no, 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 my music. <laughs> When we saw the puppets for the first time in rehearsals, we all lost our minds. When we heard the music played live for the first time, we lost our minds. Even on day one of rehearsals, walking in and seeing so many other East and Southeast Asian faces was such a powerful moment. It was amazing. I was incredibly proud of the team. It just feels so full of joy. It's an amazing night in the theatre.